to our Commander-in-Chief, His Excellency President Ferdinand Romualdez Marcos Jr., Sir, Senior Leaders of the Government, Team PMA, other distinguished guests, members of PMA Madasigan Class of 2023 and their loved ones, the Cadet Corps Armed Forces of the Philippines, mga minamahal naming kababayan, a pleasant morning to all of us. Over the past four years here in the Academy, our class had experienced the joys, triumphs, and fulfillment that come quite expectedly. Towards the end of our first year of training, we had to meet the unprecedented challenges brought about by the pandemic, as if losing two of our classmates early during our first year was not enough to break us, bodily and in spirit. The outbreak of the pandemic in 2020 was totally unexpected. For us plebs then, fresh from being severed from family, we were unable to celebrate our recognition day with our loved ones and make the most of our semestral breaks due to the surging COVID-19 cases. But these were small, indeed, when compared to what many were going through in the country and throughout the world. We were fortunate in many other ways because we were given a rare privilege to be part of this journey of countless memories, enriched with more tales of courage and confidence born out of the pandemic. On a personal note, I wish to share my story in the hope that those among our youth may be inspired. Growing up, I witnessed the hardships born out of destitution. Numerous chances for me to participate in international competitions were skipped due to financial constraints. However, I never blamed my parents for our circumstances. I distinctly remember the moment they decided to sell her house, the place where my siblings and I spent our childhood and nurtured our ambitions in order to support my sister's college education. Indeed, for me, Locking in something is but a temporary obstacle to achieving success. For a while in the academy, I was privileged to experience many new things as one of its top performing cadets. Sipag, tsaga, at determination ang naging susi sa pagbukas ng iba't ibang pinto ng oportunidad para sa akin. I had also witnessed my parents' father's commitment to serve our country as an enlisted member of the Philippine Air Force. Seeing him and other military personnel's discipline and devotion to serving our country at a very young age fueled my dream of becoming a military officer. Consequently, accepting the PMA challenge brought me closer to my aspiration. I am truly grateful to the Philippine Military Academy for molding us for all our hardship and sacrifices. We should stop for once to take pride in what we have achieved. Indeed, I am proud to say that we, the PMA Mandirigmang May Dangal, simbolo ng galing at pagbangon class of 2023, are now well equipped to render our services to our nation. We will continue to be guided by the PMA core values of courage, integrity, and loyalty in all our endeavors, particularly as we serve at the forefront of the armed forces of the Philippines. On behalf of the PMA Madasigan class of 2023, I would like to extend our gratitude to all those who have helped us reach this point. First and foremost, our parents, who are our source of inspiration. You are the reason we strive for greatness, the reason we are eager to finish our journey here. Maraming maraming salamat po. Personally, I would like to express my deepest appreciation to my beloved parents, retired Technical Sergeant Joel Leonor and Angelina Leonor, Mami. Daddy, para po sa inyo lahat ng ito, bunga po ito ng inyong mga sakripisyo para sa amin na ate. To my siblings, Ate Gladys and Ate Abby, ang tagumpay ng isa ay tagumpay nating lahat. Thank you for being my number one support system, for not letting physical distance weaken our bond, and for always being there for me. To our mentors, professors, and upperclassmen, Thank you for the valuable lessons that enabled us to survive the rigors of our cadetship. Maraming salamat po, ma'am and sirs. To all our underclassmen, we are grateful to you for providing us with the opportunity to grow as leaders. 
Your remaining years in the academy will pass by quickly. So take it one day at a time. To our dear Ms. Taz, so have departed, Cadet Darwin Dormitorio and Cadet Mario Telan Jr., you will forever be a cherished part of the Medicigan class of 2023. We thank our Almighty Father for being the fount of all our blessings and whose benevolence kept us from faltering. We are secured knowing you have the best plans for our lives. And finally, to my fellow graduates, as we reflect on the hardships and victories we experienced during our stay in the academy, I hope that we realize their value and live our lives in accord with the knowledge and values imparted to us. Let us be leaders who relentlessly pursue the welfare of others, recognizing that there is always an opportunity to serve. To the Filipino people, we are ready to serve you. Marami pong salamat at mabuhay tayong lahat.